Hey, this is Barry for Aquarium Outfitters and Fish Store, and welcome to Species Spotlight. Today we're going to be talking about the Glow Tetra. The pre-glow version of the fish originated in South America, but the glow fish were created by genetic scientists. Initially starting with the Danio fish, scientists in Singapore had been experimenting with making glow fish by injecting embryos of fish with jellyfish, anemone, and sea coral genes. After altering the genes of the fish, the fish were actually able to reproduce with this coloration. Yorktown Technologies acquired the marketing rights to the fish and branded them Glowfish. These guys were genetically altered to be a really bright, eye-catching fish whose color especially pops under a blue or black light, creating a neon glow. They are most commonly sold in bright red, green, orange, yellow, blue, and purple fluorescent colors. There's a little bit of controversy about the Glowfish, and they are banned in the state of California and in Canada. Maxing out around 2 to 3 inches, the Glow Tetra is a peaceful schooling fish that should get along fine in a peaceful community tank. They like to be in groups of three or more. While considered peaceful most of the time, I have, however, heard some reports of them being a little nippy after they've been established in a small tank. These fish would appreciate a planted aquarium, but I'm not sure how well your plants are going to do in the lighting that people usually use for these fish. It would be nice to have some rocks or decorations for them, but they do need some room to swim around. The Glow Tetra prefers a temperature from around 72 to 79 degrees. A pH from 6.5 to 7.5 would be good for them. The Glow Tetra does well on flake food, but they are omnivores, so it would be nice to give them some blood worms or brine shrimp every once in a while. The minimum recommended tank size is 10 gallons. The Glow Tetra might be a fun option for someone that wants bright, colorful, freshwater fish. They're especially popular with kids. Wouldn't it be cool if they made other fish as glow fish? Or what about a glow eel? What do you think would be a cool kind of fish to make a glow fish? Comment below. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. The Glow Tetra can live up to around five years or a little longer in the right conditions.